I am not making a lot of fans with this one, but we need to talk about one of the weakest animals out there, and it's not one of these two. The sloth is really bad at being itself. It's like taking the worst traits of pandas and koalas and putting it on a walking carpet. First, they insist on eating almost nothing but leaves, a diet that gives them virtually zero energy. Not only does it take them actual days to digest it, it's the reason they're so slow, because they actively nerf themselves to hell with their choices. Sloths are so slow that if a baby falls out of a tree, the mother won't waste her time or energy getting it back. It's basically dead to her. They can only really handle having one baby at a time. If she pops out twins, it's basically abortion with extra steps. She will 100% reject one of them. Sloths are basically koala panda hybrids without the viciousness or the pretty privilege. You will never in your life see a kung fu sloth movie. Only thing they have going for them is that they're so slow that algae literally grows on them, giving them camouflage. But since one of their biggest ops is a harpy eagle who has great eyesight, wearing a moss blanket does almost nothing. They only poop once a week and half of them get killed in the process. Why they don't just drop a deuce from the trees, I will never know. They can swim three times faster than they can move on land, but when you multiply a number that close to zero by three, it's still not impressive. Then there's this. It's not true at all, but the fact that it's believable is another indictment. Sloths are such an evolutionary disappointment that it's not just a crime, it's a downright sin. I can't go into everything wrong with them in one video, so part two is going to be on Tirzu's TikTok page tagged down below. The modern day sloth has no shortage of weaknesses. They don't really have any defense against the jungle's predators. But what if I told you that sloths weren't always a pathetic bottom tier animal? During the Ice Age, one of the most fearsome creatures you could ever run into was the giant ground sloth called Megatherium. Standing 20 feet tall and packing a fist full of huge claws, even the legendary saber-toothed cats couldn't stand up to them. Unfortunately, as is the case with most of the Ice Age megafauna, Megatherium's large size and incredible strength was useless against the invasion of a certain bipedal primate happening all around the globe. While it's a shame that Megatherium is no longer around, one of the sloth's close relatives, the giant anteater, has moments reminiscent of the family's golden age.